gotten that your latest weather. Now let's head on down to Washington, D.C. and say hello to Mr. Willard Scott. Hey, Willie. Let's check and see what our birthday buddies are today, shall we? As we turn the Smucker's Jam Jar around the old circle. Take a look, if you will. And we have the lovely Callie. I always love that name, Callie. I had an aunt named Callie Warren. Brooklyn, New York, 100 years old, devoted church member, enjoys entertaining and loves to cook for friends. And sharp as a tack, she can tell you how to make a sweet potato pie without a recipe. How about that? Can't beat it. Irwin. Hirsch, Fort Lauderdale, Florida, is 100 years old, very active, wakes up, rides an exercise, get all these exercises, rides an exercise bike every day, loves to swim and play a good game of tennis, known for being appreciative and absolutely delightful. And how fortunate, what a wonderfully lucky man to be able to do all that exercise. Lucas Garcia of Parlier in beautiful California, 100 years old, came to the United States from Mexico in 1955, worked as a farmer for years, secret to longevity, faith in the good Lord, loving his family, doing exercise and eating healthy. That's still, as always, Adam and Eve, same thing, always works. Jesse Noel of Harpers Ferry, West Virginia. If you folks have ever, never been to Harpers Ferry, one of the prettiest places in the world, I mean in the world, that's right here near Washington. Former second grade teacher for over 30 years, adores reading, huge fan of the young and the restless. And we have the young and the useless here in the newsroom. Enjoy spending time with family and friends, and that's nice. We have John Tucker. Get out the way, old John Tucker. Beaumont, Texas, 100 years old, great sense of humor. Retired lawyer, his spare time when he isn't laying down the law. He enjoys a little glass of that Tennessee magic. Little Jackie D. And he tells hilarious stories, at least after that Jack Daniels, they're hilarious. Murdas Hemphill, Oak Vale, Mississippi, 100 years old today, member of the Society Hill Baptist Church for 40 years. Former seamstress who supported the war effort by sewing parachutes, World War II, that is. Known for her beauty secret, guess what she did? You, I've heard this for years. She uses Crisco shortening as a face cream. Fantastic. Now, that's it. That's all for right now. That's good. She makes a great pie. I mean, you know, just puts it on the, and bakes it. Now back to New York. And thank you, Willard. I'm inside the health and wellness truck that's been parked.